Hey, what's up guys? Millskull here. Welcome back to Space Engineers Episode 6. When we left off, we tore down our ship. Uh, the, the landing... The lander? The atmospheric lander? We built that thing. Still haven't gotten it done yet. That's for solar panels here in a few. Uh, we also finished our conveyors for the connector and the medical room. Uh, built a few batteries. We've just been kind of doing some routine maintenance lately. I want to move solar panels today. I want them up in the sky. Uh, let's get some steel plates here. I'm going to get started right away. I got my timer going so the episode doesn't go holy cow too long again. Because, yeah, uh, those gigs pile up, my friends. Seriously, raw file, 60 some odd gigs. <laughs> yeah, ouch. That hurts a lot. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to weld this up. Get it all taken care of. Move some solar panels. Start getting some power rolling here. I think I want to have a few that catch the sunrise and a few that catch the sunset. So we're going to kind of uh, stagger them a little bit. Okay, let's see. My inventory is still super full. I can carry two of these, so I'm going to move them two at a time. Shouldn't take too long. Let's see. This one. You're the lucky contestant. Perfect. 1900 volume. I should be less than four grand. Yep. Okay, now I need solar panel. All blocks. Solar panel, perfect. I'm going to put this one for the sunrise. So I want to place this right here. Give it a little flippy do. Boop. And we'll put this one here just because. Because I could put it on the other side, but that would require me to flip it again. Oh, I guess I can weld those. All the sun's coming up. That way I can get power right away. That way we don't lose anything, you know? Beautiful. This one should have power. I want to kind of see if I can look and weld. Yep, it's got two. This one should go up to two also. Sun will be coming up here in a moment. Good, good. Put these on the same side. Or on the other side, I mean. Kind of like this. Um, I like those to be on the inside just for aesthetics. Beautiful. A wee. Okay. Jetpack on. Grinder. I know. <laughs> See you guys sitting here upside down. Alright, let's get up there. Let's see, how do I want to do this? Sun rises behind me and sets kind of in an odd place. Let's see, sun rises and it kind of goes like this and arcs like over there, I want to say. Um, so I'm thinking we're going to put two, or these two facing that direction. So let's go down here. Because I don't want them to get shaded too bad. So we're going to put them like right below as if we were um, yeah, just like that. They'll get shade on the well, you know what? Maybe they should go right here. So we only have six right now, but One there. One there. Perfect. Because, yeah, they'll get shaded uh, a little bit when the sun rises, but then when it sets, they should be getting full power. Look at these. These are all getting full power right now. 
sun isn't even over the hill so that's kind of what I wanted to happen and that's why I put them up so high oh geez that looks so weird okay uh, my baby just cried I think mom's got her pretty sure mom's got her all right cuz yeah I'm up too late as usual it's midnight it's midnight guys Heck to the yeah. Oxygen, assembler, refinery. What are we doing? How is this ship doing? Let's take a look. I want to go inventory, control panel, battery, depleted. Ah, oh, it's losing power, isn't it? Oh, 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 I'm also dying. I'm also dying because it doesn't have oxygen. That's not good. Not good, man. Hmm, how can we combat this? Um, I want to look at the battery power here. Low station fuel, control panel. Our batteries are actually charging, so that's good. I think we should make solar panels then. We should make a ton. Uh, do I have any solar cells left? No. Let's see. Okay, production. Let's go a uh, large block. I'm gonna find our solar panel, wherever it is. I think they're at the bottom. Yep. Let's make. Uh... Hmm. We can make a bunch. Let's make ten of them. And I'll just start going crazy. And yeah, that would be a good use of materials, I think. Let's look at production. I want to make sure we have enough silicon wafers. We need about 500. Um, hmm. Are we really going to run out of silicon? No way. Okay, yeah, we got five over 5,000, so that's good. Uh, nickel, six 600-ish. Nickel, nickel, nickel. We got 2.5k, so that's good. Um, what else? An iron we have more than plenty of, so that's good. We can kind of group some of these together just to make production a little easier. Um, that way we don't have to wait so long for each solar panel to build. So yeah, we're just going to kind of pile these together. As much as we can anyway. Now, I wish that they would autopile, but I kind of see why they don't. Get in there. Boop. Kind of. I kind of see. <laughs> okay, so we need 10 solar panels. Solar cells are going to be a big one. They're going to take forever. Gonna move that down the list. All of this goes ahead. Okay, that should be good enough. All right, and then a bunch of solar cells. Beautiful. Let's take a hundred steel plates. Let's go up and uh, work out where we want these things. So, um, I say we do something like this. We're gonna go number nine. We're gonna go one there. Oh, construction components. Jeez, it's one thing or the other, isn't it? Boop. There we go. That'll do. And yeah, I'm just building the solar panels like that because it doesn't really matter. I don't want to use all of our material that we already have for these. Um, there's two. Okay. And then we can kind of do something like, since the sun doesn't really come over on this side too much, I think we can get away with... Uh, Ah, oh, come on. There we go. Doing more here. Like this. So we can go one, two, three, four. Okay, so we got. How many did we lay so far? We did two, three, four, five, six. 
Now we can do four more. So let's go four um, right here. One, two, and yeah, I hope you guys can see what I'm why I'm placing the solar panels kind of weird because I could just build a big fan, but there we go. But yeah, this is kind of to catch the sun on a few different angles. So we'll have these for like sunset. Uh, if they get some sun from the sunrise, cool. If they don't, oh well. Not a big deal. And yeah, we'll start going going for it. Okay, so I've got 10, so we add a zero to it. So we need 100 construction components, 10 large steel tubes. Uh, let's put these back and just grab a solid 100. 10 large steel tubes. What else? Uh, 40 steel plates. Oh, I already had them, but there we go. 40 steel plates, 20 computers. And 640 solar cells. <laughs> That's going to be a big one. That's all right. We've we're we're go we're getting there. So yeah, this should take care of everything but the solar cells. And we'll just kind of, doesn't matter. We don't have to complete them. Good. Yeah. Uh, space Engineer's math is pretty pretty awesome <laughs> you just gotta learn the tricks so yeah that should have taken care of uh, I, I was off on construction components unless I missed one but whatever or maybe I already placed a few because I had some on me okay um, how are we doing we have a few let's grab uh, as many as we can so that should be enough to get uh, 64 and 64 is 128, so we can get two of them done. I think we'll do Sunrisers. Let's do the first two, because these will catch the most sun. That one and this one. And then we can place them on this just to get started. I gotta check my gas, too. Golden. We are golden, my friends. Can I carry? I can carry a few more. 172, I think. Eight more. Six, seven, eight. And there's our sunrise. Ah, gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now we should be making better power too. Because it doesn't hurt to have too much power in this game. Oh, I guess I forgot to place a few. That's okay. We'll get there, right? Guess we can just get the rest of them prepped, right? And by sunset, I should have these ones done. Um, <laughs> well, before sunset, I hope, because... Oh my gosh, I don't want to do this all all episode. I want to take the... I want to get that on the connector, too, so it can start storing some of this power. Maybe I should do that right now, while we're waiting. No fuel. Ah, friggin' helmet on. No fuel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I need to go into here. Let's go thrusters on. Batteries are good. I think they're both on. Yes. We 
We've got thrust. Let's hit the parking brake. Give it some lift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh. I'm hearing uh, thrusters turning off and stuff. Scary, scary, scary. I forgot a backup camera on this. Tilt. Lift. Reverse. Oh man, we go reverse awesome. Park it. Connectors enabled. Um, let's go to our control panel. Let's see how the batteries are doing now. Oh good, they're charging. That's a good sign. Yeah. Good times. Ten hours. <laughs> That's okay, cause um, cause yeah, it sh it it'll start. It'll just keep charging. We'll be okay. Now that we're catching some sunlight, it's gonna be very very good. And once we quit um, assembling, will be even better. So yeah, we are. I think we're averting our uh, power crisis right now. Oh man, got all those solar panels done? That's awesome. We got two more. And they have zero plates to go on them. Let's see. We should have 128 to go. Yep. And yeah, that'll just be a waiting game, I guess. I want to set one of these. Ah, do I want to? Oh, they're still charging too. That's even better. Because we're charging this, and we have enough power to get to that. So that's actually really cool. Let's fully discharge uh, battery 2. I want to name this battery one just because we have a battery two I must have broke it at some point or placed it and then broke it and placed it again okay battery one you are going to be set to full discharge I want all your power out which will charge other batteries and this one also which we can't see the it's just tucked in there really good I have my helmet on, so I gotta watch that. That cuts it down a ton. Let's go thrusters off. I actually have a group, so maybe I should set that. Um, groups. Let's go batteries here. Um, oh, no, no, no. I don't want batteries. I want thrusters. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on. Weapons, tools, drills. There we go. And then batteries. Or no, thrusters. We'll toggle that on and off. Cool. So now we hit the two key. That happens. We can use our mouse to do that. Yeah, we're good. Now how long will it take with the thrusters off? <laughs> More time. <laughs> okay, how about this? We'll go batteries, set them to recharge. Oh, look at that. 11 minutes. Jeez, what are we powering on this thing? Seriously. Uh, maybe I should turn the gyroscopes down. Let's go to 50% on each of them. There we go. That should use a lot less power. Cool. I like it. Helmet off. So yeah, we need air inside that thing, which really bugs me. But it is an airtight compartment, so it makes sense that if it doesn't have supplied oxygen, it has to get it from somewhere. Just a thought. Just a thought, guys. Okay. Man, what are we doing? We're finishing that. How are we on the solar cells? Beautiful, all of them. So we'll have our sunset. Or no, our sunrise. Our other two sunrise ones. But do you see why I place the solar panels that way? Yeah. Um, 
We'll probably have four more down here maybe at some point, but not today. I think if we can, we can take our miner out because that would be really sweet if we could do that today. I see a light. Oh, I'm trying to inspect the light. Not quite. <laughs> Can't really see it. Dang it. Uh, did I say we needed more lift? I think our... Well, yeah, we probably do. Small thrusters. Small atmospheric thruster. Number nine. Let's put them right there. I need something. What do I need? Steel plates. For this thing, it shouldn't take a ton. Right there. Just like that. No, I can't. Ooh, that's right. I have to place it. Ah, oh, it's gonna look junky there, but whatever. Let's do it. I pointed that the right way, didn't I? I better of. Whatever. It's fine. It's cool with me. Should be cool with you guys, right? Uh, probably construction components. Probably motors. Probably computer. Probably large steel tubes. Maybe small steel tubes. I'm just wildly guessing at what these take. Metal grids. Stupid metal grids. Well, at least we have a ton of them, right? Metal grids. I need two of them. Perfect. Oh man, best mining ship ever. You guys haven't seen a cool mining ship like this, have you? It's like the best one. Yeah, see, that's why I created that space right there. It's efficient. I love it. <laughs> This thing's gotta be charged now. Holy cow. I'm dying. Helmet. Seriously, let's go mining. Let's go mining right now. Battery. Eight minutes. Uh, you know what? We're doing it. Thrusters on. Parking brake. Good. View. Let's go get ourselves. Oh man, we are using a ton of power. Um, let's see, where do we want to go? I want to get this gold. Just as a test. There it is. Like I said, this thing's got some serious braking power for what it is. Here we go, guys. Maiden Voyage of the Muley Miner, or Miner 1, I guess. Uh, it's actually under... It's actually about 20,000 kilograms. That's not bad. It's a little ship. Very little ship. I want to see how much weight it can carry, too, uh, before it becomes overburdened. Should be getting gold already. It holds steady, uh, turns on a dime. I could probably turn the gyros down a little more, just because it's a minor. It doesn't have to make super drastic maneuvers. And yeah, it's, uh, it's good. I like it. We are now carrying more than the ship weighs. And it still backs up, so we're good. Is it falling? I don't think it's falling. 
think it's got enough thruster power to keep going. Let's see if we can get it to 100k. See if we can get to 100k, uh, I think that would be good enough to not overburden the ship too much. Okay, we're at 100k. I can still back up. Oh, but it's heavy. <laughs> like, we're at full thrust right now. Um, barely gaining. Barely gaining speed. It's flippy do. Still holds this way. It's got enough thrust that way. It speeds up, because I think we have, uh... Well, we're not fighting gravity right now, too. That's good. Yeah, we can hold about 75,000 kilograms. Um, cargo container is about maxed out, so that's good, and that's about how I want it. So 100k limit is what I'm going to call this ship. ship fuel low. And yeah, you got to think about those things when you're playing on a planet, guys, <laughs> in this game, because weight matters. Uh, even if you're leaving space, oh man, oh jeez, yeah, it's not, I mean, I got a good, it'll, it'll hold steady, but it's a heavy some bitch. <laughs> okay, there we go, let's lock it, everything should empty, beautiful, all goes to the refinery to get processed, we got a ton of stone out of that, but we also got a ton of, uh, ton of gold. I mean, 20,000 20, just from that little boulder right now. So that's good. That is very, very good for us. Um, let's go to the control panel. What are the batteries doing? They are recharging. Cool. Let's turn off the thrusters. We're locked. Thrusters off. Batteries. Oh no, battery one. Battery 2. Okay, we can actually set these batteries to recharge when we're not using it. And yeah, it's, it's an okay little ship. I don't like that it doesn't have oxygen, but I think it saves on weight. Um, yeah, need some landing gears. So, but yeah, I mean a 20,000 kilogram ship that can carry about, f about five times its weight is... Because, I mean, I could have packed it a little more, but then we're just flirting with uh, disaster at that point. Motor. There we go. That should be a landing gear. Landing gear. I want a couple more. But, yeah, the science involved in this game is pretty awesome. I love it. It just, like, you can immerse yourself so easily. It's backwards, isn't it? Ah, oh, jeez. I hate that the landing gear is, like, flippy-do everywhere. There we go. Right there. Yeah. Now how much is away? With two more landing gears. Oh, we're still, we're under 20,000, so holy cow, this thing does carry five times its weight. That's friggin' sweet. Okay. Cool. And yeah, it's good for uh, just getting materials as we need them. We can also refit the ship with uh, oxygen when we get the time. But right now, it does what it needs to do, and that's just get... A good amount of material very quickly close to home uh, I don't want to take it on a super huge voyages quite yet uh, we have enough iron I think we should start building the base out a little bit we'll probably start that next episode um, probably build a big platform over here and start building something to go to space because, yeah, I'm ready. Need still plates for that. Gosh, I just want to place blocks. I still got a little time, guys. Let's just... Just go crazy, Mealy. Get a thousand plus. Gotta refill my health, too. Because I I will forget and I will die. Okay. Um, there's our power room. How's about we build it... Is 
yeah, that's... It should make it more of an even number, because we do have a limit of how many steel plates we can make right now. What am I doing? One, two, three, four. We'll go ten. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we'll go nine this way. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, look at that, it almost lines up. Oh. Almost. <laughs> almost lines up. We could actually take this down too. Kind of done with that spotlight right there. Oh. Heavy. Heavy spotlight. Yeah, let's place a few blocks. Pick up that stuff and put our spotlight somewhere else. Um. I think right here would actually be it. Holy moly, those batteries are trained big time, aren't they? What are you doing, battery one? You're on discharge. How about you go on f uh, recharge also? That ship, let's let it charge up and then it won't charge anymore. Okay, and I kind of want to put a spotlight. We'll put it up here. That seems like a good spot. And yeah, the Earth base doesn't need to be super fancy and stuff. It just needs to get us to another planet and have a little base, a little place to call home, you know. Pick up this junk. Steel tubes first. Oh, just the one steel tube, I guess. Gosh, that wasn't a very heavy spotlight. And yeah, that should shine on this, I would think. Let's get this platform built. Holy moly. This will be a good little landing pad for... Uh, well, good launch pad, because once we leave Earth, I don't think we're going to be coming back unless we need to make a serious emergency maneuver or something, you know? Like, there's no ice. <laughs> we haven't found ice for three days, and we need it, so we got to come back and get some. Or, uh, oh, oops. Muley forgot. Power cells, or... <laughs> Muley didn't bring any iron. <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. You never know. I've made it all the way out. Um, outside of a planet. Probably a good 120 kilometers or so. And forgot oxygen stuff. Like for a generator and a tank. To build a station. Um, and yeah, it was a minimalist ship. Something that was just supposed to go to space, build a little station, and who cares after that? Maybe go to Earth? I don't know. Alien planet? But yeah. Maybe get refueled and use it for something. I don't know. Get torn down. Who knows? <laughs> but yeah. Forget all the oxygen stuff when you go to space. That's terrible. All right, my friends, I think that's enough for today. Oh, look at that. Look at that. See, and now we're only covering part of the panels back here, but that's okay, because those are for sunrises. Sunset ones are getting lots of sun. My friends, it's time. It's time to call it a day. So, I want to... Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Leave me a like, comment, subscribe, tell your friends, and I will see you guys in the next one. Watch this. Bye. See you later.